Alright, welcome back, Sugar Plums. In this episode, we're going to find out what this fire does! Woo! Oh, God. I, I built that up to be so stupid. This is so stupid. <laughs> oh, man. I'm insane. Anyways, welcome back to another exciting episode of uh, Ocarina of Time. We're going to go underneath this waterfall. Because, you know, that's what happens. And we unlock this chest. So pretty snazzy. Man, there's just so much random stuff to do. Um, that's what always happens when there's a new area. Hey, piece of heart! We're collecting them like a b Oh my god, glitching through the chest. I'm gonna get away from this waterfall. Alright. Darn, I'm gonna need one of those. Um, by those I mean the fish. Oh, I should have used the milk. Oh well. But the milk gives you two servings, and I can always get another fairy easily. So whatever. I got a fish in a bottle. Here we go and cook later tonight. I wish catching fish was actually that easy. Oh yeah, since I've been here, I haven't actually talked to Azora. Hi. Are you a man or a woman? Or maybe you're some sort of unisex creature. Who cares? Who are you? We are the Zoras, the Pout Aquatic People. So, do you say you have your connection with the royal family? Well, what do you want from us? I have to say, I've always liked how they looked, even in this game. And as time goes on, they just keep getting cooler and cooler looking. In other Zelda games, they just get so cool. Anyways, so we're gonna go back up here, but we're not talking to the king yet. Oh no, we're not talking to him yet. We're gonna come over here and ignore him completely. Because this is, again, something we need to do. Hi! Diving game, 20 rupees. Want to play? Hells yeah! Alright. Pick up all the rupees I throw from here, and you only have a limited amount of time. When you pick them all up, come back here. I'll give you something very nice. Oh, yes. Oh, man, he's just throwing money away. Start! Oh, epic dive! I wish I could dive as epically as Child Link can dive. All right. So we only have 38 seconds, but we already have. So we get all our money back. I don't know. I guess it only costs money because he doesn't want you keeping his money. Hooray! I've got something nice for you. Come and get it. All right. We're going to head right back up there because uh, we earned it. Because we can't... That hole that's down there, we can't get there yet until we do this. So, yeah. Again, though, I'm not going to talk to the king at all. He's not important yet. He's only important until... Or, uh, we don't need to talk to him until we get something else. Which we will get by getting this thing. Which is taking me forever to say. But hey, you know what? Don't even matter. Let's talk to this guy. Hey, dude. Wah! What a graceful dive. Now please save this. It's a scale of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper underwater. Ah! Zoomed in on his face. You got the silver scale. Awesome! Wowie! God, Child Link has the most, like, graceful dives ever. So, yeah, obviously, we dive a lo longer. Ah, so, Lake Hylia. Oh, hello, fellow creature. I am a Zora. Have you seen anything strange in the lake? The river carries many strange things into this lake. I added a word there, but I don't care. Yep, I do. It's right over here. I got it. You got an empty bottle. Put something inside and press C to use it. What? Something's already inside? What is this madness? Well, let's just go back over here. 
We have no more need to do anything in Lake Hylia just now. Yeah, there's a lot of like going back and forth up this spiral tower to the king. Um, so yeah. Anyways, let's look at let's look at the bottle. What does it say? Oh. So what does the bottle say? Oh, it doesn't tell me. Oh, well, I gotta equip it. You know, let me save. All right. Forgot to save in between sessions, and uh, that'd be bad. That'd be very, very bad. So, yep. Yeah. Just trucking up to uh, to King to to King Fish Gills. Oops, I fell. Um, forgive me, King. I seem to have fallen off the ledge uh, while I was staring at your glorious belly. Oh, I have to read those. Huh? Looks like there's something already inside this bottle. It's a letter. Help me! I'm waiting for you inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly. Ruto. P.S. Don't tell my father. Well, of course, what am I going to do? I'm going to immediately... No. Don't. Stop. No, I know! Let me skip it, please. Oh, fine. I can't seem to talk to you from over there, so I'm gonna just uh, excuse myself and come right up here. Um, hello? Why are you untalkable? Um... I'm here. Hello? Your... Your Ruto's father. No! God! I don't know what's going wrong! I don't know what I'm doing wrong! I've never had problems with this. It's Let's Player's Curse. Okay, come on. There we go! Now I can- I was standing too fucking close. Sorry, I can only talk when I'm far away. Ugh, God. Let's see. She's inside Lord Jabu Jabu? That's not possible! Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto! But since that stranger, Ganondorf, came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. The evidence seems clear. Of course she'll go to find Ruto. Wait, what? I just told you your daughter's missing. You don't want to go? Get up your fat ass? No? Uh, you can pass through here to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. Well, alright then. I'll keep this letter. You keep the bottle it was in. Take it respectfully. See, in this universe, bottles are the most treasured item in the world. Great! Hurry up! We gotta go! Alright. Yeah. He takes forever. And he should've just rolled forward or something, got off, or stood up, walked three feet, then sat back down instead of scooching his ass slowly over the frickin' waterfall. Why are you sitting in a waterfall anyways? God. What if it was a Goron who wanted to come talk to you? No, I don't want to talk to you. Yes, I know, I know. Okay, I'm going, I'm going! So, uh, yeah, now we have three out of the four empty bottles, so that's pretty damn cool. And I know where the last one is, too. And it's not fun. But, gotta do it. You guts to do it. Oh, this is Lord Jabu Jabu. I love that name, Jabu Jabu. All right, so we're actually going to. This is a dungeon. Uh, Zelda has a has a knack for going in, or Link in this case, I guess, has a knack for going inside of giant creatures. We went inside the Deku Tree, and now we have to go inside of Lord Jabu Jabu in order to prep to rescue. Guess what? A princess. 
So in this game, we rescue not one, but two princesses! Oh yeah! I love his design too, he's so cool looking. Alright. So, we're just gonna plop this fish on the floor as an offering. Ah. He's gonna open on up. Oh, good fish! Nom nom nom! Yeah, that one fish! <laughs> and then he, he sucks us up as well. Thanks, Lord Jabu Jabu. Uh, inside Jabu Jabu's belly. So, those are teeth. If this is not the most frightening thing you've ever seen, I submit that you are lying and I need to change my shield. Hey, you. Hey, you. So, yeah. We're already on our third dungeon. Come on. Come on, you bubble. Bubble. You bubble. I hate all of these water monsters. God, water horribles are the worst. Ever. We're gonna hit you. This giant pimple. Ew. It's probably a cold sore. Gross. So yeah, we're just running around inside of a living thing. If that's not creepy, I don't know what is. And we're also- we're- we're a child! Um, okay, that thing's creepy over there. Huh? Oh, look! Oh! <gasps> She's so pretty! I actually, you know, a lot of people make fish. She's like, ew, it's a fish person. I actually think she's really adorable. Then again, I'm really into sci fi and I love aliens and how they look and shit, so this is not anything out of the ordinary. Um, I am Ruto, Princess of the Zoras. What? Are you saying my father asked you to come in here and save me? I'd never ask anyone to do such a thing. Letter in a bottle? I have no idea what you're talking about. What, did Ganondorf write out a letter in a bottle? Heh <laughs> Go in there, save her. Heh <laughs> Uh, I don't care. Wow, what a spoiled brat, though. Uh, anyways, I can't go home right now. And you, get out of here. Understood? Huh! Oh, well. Okay. I was about to say, you wouldn't walk there. Obviously, it looks like it's quicksand. So long, suckers! Hi. God, that sound is so creepy. No, I don't care. I don't want to look. You'll be electrocuted. I want to speak to her. Oh, look, there's something over there. Are you still hanging around here? I told you to go away. I'm okay. I've been going inside Lord Jabu Jolly's belly since I was little, but... Lord Jabu Jabu is very strange... Why? May I ask why you've been going inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly? I mean, that seems a little bit odd. There's a lick, and Lord Jabu Jabu also was a product of the Time Lords because he's bigger on the inside. Strange holds. To top that off, my precious stone was. Up. Oh, I think we know where we got the the Zora one. It's from her. That's none of your business. Anyway, you go home now. Understood? No. You're that worried about me? <laughs> I don't know what that voice was, but... Uh, then I will give you the honor of carrying me. However, I won't leave until I find the thing I'm looking for. You better believe me. She, she, she's adorable. So yeah, we're just gonna carry her around. So... Oh yeah, you can use her as a weapon. <laughs> I think that's just the funniest shit ever. Okay, we're not going to... Oh, why'd you bounce, princess? You need to not bounce. Come here. Come here, bubble. Hey, you. You- you killed Steve Irwin! Die! He was my favorite when I was a child. 
Alright. I'm sorry, Steve Irwin joke. Too, too soon. It's, well, no, it's not even a joke. You know what? I loved Steve Irwin. He was an awesome person. He taught me lots of things about things I never knew I would know about. Okay, can't climb up there yet, so we're gonna hit this, this switch in the middle here. The water's gonna rise. It's on a timer though, so I'm probably gonna have to do it again. Because I'm... I'm gonna replace that thing that I had. Oh yeah, that, that thing, I mean, a fairy. Alright. And, um... Alright, so... Ugh. I think, um, after I finish this room, we're gonna end the episode. Yeah. Just because we're getting up there in time. Yep. But hey, we got Ruto. It's all good in the... It's all good. Alright. We're gonna ignore you. We don't really need to kill these things. They're just more annoying than anything. You know what? Let's throw her at him! Oh, I hit her! I hit her! I hit the switch with her. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, I killed those with my face. So, good on me! Good on me. And we're gonna end the episode here! Oh my god!